PA, woman is claiming I 21M am the father of her 8-year-old daughter. She is threatening me with family court. A week ago a woman came knocking on my front door. When I answered she claimed that I am the father of her 8-year-old daughter. I'm 21 and male. The problem is I have never met this woman in my damn life and more so I've never had sex with a woman in my life. Today it happened again and she told me if I don't agree to child support she will take me to court. I don't know what to do at all in this situation and I'm asking for any advice I can. I would let the police handle it. If seeing she doesn't recognize you didn't tip her off that she is wrong then this is a scam or she has cognitive issues. Either way, don't interact and call the police. Refuse to engage with her any further. If she files for paternity, and you are correct that you've never seen this person before, then the DNA test would very quickly end the whole discussion. Not to mention that the math means he was 12 years old and depending on her age, it might be rape. It's a scam. 100%. If she pesters you again, let her know that you look forward to getting it all worked out in court the way support should be handled and that when you hear from her lawyer, you will respond appropriately. In the unlikely event you do receive a letter purporting to be from a lawyer, look up the number for the firm on their website, call and ask if they sent you a letter from, lawyer's name, about a case. Do not discuss the case, just confirm that the letter is legitimate or not. If it's not, they'll be very interested in someone impersonating a lawyer from their firm. If it is, legitimate, hang up and call a lawyer of your own. It's very unlikely to be legit. What to do? If she comes back, don't answer the door. If that results in craziness, call PD. Do not respond to any calls, texts, social media drops from her or regarding this matter. If you are served with court papers, consider consulting a lawyer for advice. Agree to nothing until a paternity test is done. Then agree to nothing without legal representation if somehow you are the father. I am wondering if you have the same name as someone else and she can't or won't figure out the aging thing or has poor memory. Otherwise I would assume this is a scam. But the side of me that wants to watch the world burn also wonders if you have the same name as your father and plot twist it's your sibling. But again, I am weird. My father had been dead longer than that girl is old. I'm sorry. Definitely a scam, don't engage. Call the police if she continues to harass you. You might even have a civil case against her. Info. What is the approximate age of this woman? Is she suggesting she committed a crime by having sex with a 12-year-old? If that doesn't jog her memory I don't know what will. Not exactly legal advice, but come on. From what I can tell 30 to 38. Well if you see her again, let her know the conversation is being recorded and ask her if she is saying she had sex with a 12-year-old. She's either in dire need of professional help or she is trying to scam you into giving her money to go away. Either is alarming, but even more so if she's doing this at your front door. Assuming that you're being truthful in stating that you did not have sex with this woman when you were 12 or 13 years old, and I believe that you are then you have no reason to not report this and any subsequent encounters to police. She shows up, ignore her and call the police to talk to her themselves. If they feel that she's not of sound mind, they can engage other resources to help deal with her. At best, she'll get the hint that you're not picking up what she's throwing down and will disappear. At worst, she truly believes you fathered her baby, convinces an attorney as such and takes you to court, at which point a paternity test will fully absolve you of any responsibility. File a restraining order against her if she continues to harass you. If she takes you to court, it can be cleared up with a simple paternity test. I don't even know her name. How would I file a restraining order? Next time she shows up call the police, they can get her name. Through her court filing. If she shows up again, call the police. They will happily determine her identity. Go to the local precinct and speak to a cop. Then next time she shows up don't open the door and call the cops. This is either a scam or a misunderstanding but she is harassing you at this point so you have the right to call the cops. You would have been 13. If she is older it could be statutory rape. It can't be statutory rape if op has never met this woman before. I think she's between 30 to 38. Don't do this. She will incorporate it into her scam and try to get you to pay for it, 
but will keep the money and give you a fake report saying it's your kid. Let them file for child support, then the test goes through them and the state. 